Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm back again with another update to the Exceed Mad Beast. Uh, like in the last video, I uh, updated the uh, truck. I told you I'd gone through the rear gearbox and everything else. <clears throat> and so far, so good. I did just tear the uh, transmission out of the, the truck, and I went ahead and I went and uh, checked that out. I found that there was some grease in the trans, but not a lot. The gears barely had a coating. Uh, so I went ahead and um, cleaned it all out and re-lubricated it with that uh, Lucas Oil Marine Grease. So now uh, the front, rear, and transmission all are greased. Everything appears to be on the up and up. Now one thing I wanted to go into was about this guy right here. I figured out exactly how to get this to work with that ESC. Okay, well, let me see. Let me find the instructions for that. The instructions on this thing are actually pretty misleading. Um, let me see if I can't open this page up here. We'll. Yeah, it's gonna fight me here. Give me a second. I'm doing this one-handed, of course. Okay, no, this ain't the paperwork for it. Alright, well, anyway. We'll come down here. The user manual of WPSC8RTR, blah, blah, blah. Alright, here's all the specifications that you need to know about the ESC. Um, and then there's just a bunch of different uh, things, setting it up, calibrating it to your radio, and setting up the uh, program values and everything else. But that's not what we're after here. What we are after is the instructions for the card. Which here we are, I found them. Let me pull these out. Okay. Now, if we get the phone here to focus, like right now today it's working pretty good. see using here it says disconnect the RX cable to the ESC trio wires from your receiver then connect it to the program box okay that right there is wrong at least for this speed control I'll show you how you get that to work first you got to come over here move these wires out of the way you come down here to your fan okay let me see if I can't get that fan unplugged here real quick. I might actually have to break out the needle nose pliers for this. Okay, no, did I get it? Now I got it, okay. Okay, now. Now that's unplugged, right? See? And there, there's three little pins. All right, now what we do, take the speed control. Now remember the orientation. The black is on the end, the red is in the middle. So you want to make sure that the black is on the right side of the pins. Because right now we're looking at the truck from the back side of the truck. So the truck would be driving away from me in its position that it's currently in. Okay, now, as you can see, right there, the program card is plugged into the ESC. Okay, now what i got to do is plug the batteries in. Let me see if I can get the battery here to plug in. Got one. Let me get the other one here. Sorry, I'm doing this one-handed. Bear with me. Okay, here we go. Now we're going to go ahead and turn it on. Come on. There you go. And there you go. That is how you program this particular ESC for your Exceed Mad Beast. And then you go through your modes, or item, item, as you can see here, three, item value three, value, value six, and you only get up to the five options. The advanced settings, uh, you don't get these, I think, on this ESC. Um, 
I don't know, maybe if that's a software update or not. Maybe not for this. Maybe it's just a very plain basic speed control that doesn't allow you to do it. But there you go. I figured it out. I wanted to share that. So if you do ever buy this particular RC or uh, uh, you end up getting that speed control, which is the uh, WPSC8RTR speed control, um, now you'll know how to program it properly because if you follow the instructions like this paperwork says it'll never work and what, how I figured it out is I just decided one day I just decided to try it I'm like well it's positive negative and a signal so I'm like well you know let's see what the speed control uh, see what the fan runs on and the fan had three pins and I was like well let's give it a shot and see if that takes care of it and it did so there you go um, so now basically uh, we're I, I tuned the speed control a little bit um, so the truck is ready to uh, ready to go on a maiden voyage for the most part uh, just waiting on the uh, items I had ordered that I explained in my last video to come in so uh, yeah there you go uh, so I'm glad I was able to share that with any of you uh, fellow YouTubers out there who may have this truck, have this speed control, and uh, find that uh, you're in the same boat that I'm in and couldn't figure out why that thing wouldn't program. So now, uh, now you know. So, alrighty, have a good day, YouTube.